percent of people in the U.S. can't read here at ABC2. We're working for you, trying to make sure that no child in Baltimore goes without access to books. It's part of our parent company, Scripps, if you give a child a book campaign. And we've got Lauren Cook leading ABC2's efforts. She's live in the Maryland Book Bank's bookmobile right now. Lauren, that van just goes all over helping lots of kids. It certainly does, Christian. This is a library on wheels. It distributes books to underprivileged kids in and around the Baltimore area. And ABC2 employees, we have been collecting books. We collected over a thousand books and we raised more than a thousand dollars of our own money to buy more books to give to kids here in the area. And we're giving everything to the Maryland Book Bank, a great organization. Here to tell us more about the Maryland Book Bank is Executive Director Mark Firing. Mark, thank you so much for joining us. For having me. Tell me about your organization. Okay, the Maryland Book Bank collects and distributes hundreds of thousands of books every year to children throughout the state with a primary focus here in Baltimore. And the Ravens Bookmobile has been an incredible vehicle to get the books out to kids that allows them to pick the books that they want so in the first year alone we were able to give out over 70,000 books to 15,000 children and we're looking to double that number this year um, so we need more books and it's constant we need books all the time so anyone who has anything can drop them off at the Maryland Book Bank anytime what type of literacy struggles do kids here in Baltimore face? Oh, sure. It, lower income children have between zero and two books at home, whereas middle income children have upwards of 54. The disparity in vocabulary is huge. And the result is a 16% higher chance of kids not making it through high school. Uh, they're not proficient by the third grade, so then they can't read to learn, which is really important. Uh, because from that point on, you know, it's an ongoing struggle. They actually statistically can never catch up to their peers if they're not proficient by the third grade. So one of the reasons why we do this at this grade level from pre-K to third grade is to make sure that these children have the tools that they need in order to be successful. Well, we appreciate you coming by, and it's our pleasure to be a part of the Maryland Book Bank and help give back to the kids here in Baltimore.